Hello Internet, welcome to a quick tutorial on the Pythagorean Triple. So, some of you who are following my most recent series will know I built this thing behind me and was having some trouble with the sort of thruster arm placements. Namely, that it was hard to get the merge block into a position that was easy to connect to on the main grid. They didn't line up. Well, one of my commenters turned me on to the idea of the Pythagorean Triple which is a facet of the Pythagorean theorem, the a squared plus b squared equals c squared, that gives you three whole number lengths for the sides of your triangle. So I built some testing stuff and did some math. The lowest triangle you can do for Pythagorean triple is three sides by four sides by five sides, with the fi five length side being the hypotenuse. The first thing to note in space engineers is that this number, the threes, fours, and fives, are counted from the very middle of the hinge block. So if we look at it from here, this point right here is where our counting begins. So, for my little measurement jig here, that is one block, two blocks, three blocks to the middle of here, and then we have one block, two blocks, three blocks, four blocks to the middle of this block. And as you can see, this merge block lines up perfectly on this block here. Now, because we don't tend to count blocks the way that you need to for this math to work out, essentially it means that our three, four, five triangle is one, two, three, four blocks by one, two, three, four, five, by, and this one's a little bit hard to measure, but one, two, three, four, five, six. Essentially, you just add an extra block to each length, and that will get you what you need. Now, the angles to make this work are 36.87 degrees and 53.13 degrees. That's just, you know, how it works out. But that lets you have, essentially, these two positions that are both in line with whole block lengths on one grid. 